Good day guys, uh, today I'm going to talk about the uh, type of uh, different type of uh, EGR cooling pipe. So this is the uh, Nissan Navara D40 uh, Euro 3 engine. Uh, in most of the 2006 early versions uh, comes without the uh, water uh, without the water cooling uh, uh, type of uh, EGR pipe. Uh, basically this is uh, uh, that type of uh, EGR cooling pipe. So this does not have a water cooling system straight forward you know just connected from the exhaust to the uh, inlet. So this is uh, how it has been connected in a Euro 3 engine. So here I have a two other different type of uh, EGR cooling pipes uh, that have removed from the D40 uh, Euro 4 engine. Uh, one's with the square uh, one square pipe and the other one with the uh, the round one. The only difference between the square one and the uh, round one is the uh, square one can be uh, detached for, uh, that fit. Uh, part fit into the uh, uh, EGR. Uh, the round one is is, is is not detachable, straight fit. But I feel you know it's very strong uh, when you touch and feel it. Uh, the round one. So these two EGRs are represent as a kind of a radiator cool down. So inside there are two different cores. One to flow through the exhaust gas, and other one other core to flow through the uh, the water or the, the engine cooling system. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate with this by filling up the water so you can see once, once I fill from uh, one side the other side is it's all flowing basically it goes through the core and then it cool down the exhaust gas that uh, comes out of the uh, exhaust system and goes into the EGR so there are advantage and disadvantage both I'm going to talk about this in a different video thank you guys